Hello there, how's it going guys? Like Butter here, and 26 days left until Halo 4. I think this is episode 5 of my Road to Halo 4 series. How's everybody doing tonight? I'm posting this a little bit later on in the nighttime, so if you're seeing this a day later, no worries, it'll probably be 25 days by the time you see this. But anyways, today I decided to switch it up a little bit with what I was playing as a game type, and I was doing traditional Slayer, you know, over and over again, and I was getting some comments on my last video saying, Drew, you know, you should switch up the game types, and, you know, in extremely polite ways. They were like, I'm just trying to give you some suggestions, and like I said, I always take suggestions into consideration so if you have any ideas for the next video what you guys want for maybe a game type uh, maybe you want Halo Reach or Halo 3 let me know in the comment section I do go through all the comments especially on these Halo videos because they seem to not get as many comments as my Gears videos but that's good because I can actually go through them and get your opinions what we're playing today is zombies now I've never really been a huge zombies guy I know some of you out there uh, you know who have been playing Playing zombies since you know Halo 3 or Halo 2 whatever it may be I don't even know if they had it in Halo 2 but I know they had it in Halo 3 because I used to play it and uh, basically if you've never played this uh, I think it's like two or three people start on the zombie team and basically what they have to do is they have to run around and kill all of the survivors um, you know the people who aren't zombies who aren't infected have a pistol and a shotgun that's all they have to defend themselves and I, the zombies have, um, you know, they have the sprinting ability just like, you know, the survivors do. But they also have increased movement speed and increased uh, gravity, you know, like less gravity so they can jump higher and stuff like that. So it makes the zombies a little more hard to shoot uh, because they're running fast and stuff. So it's a really cool game type. I was never really, like I said, I never really got into it. And as you can see here, I was just spraying my pistol because I wasn't completely sure if it was a one-shot pistol headshot. But if you saw a little bit earlier um, I was actually shooting someone in the head and they weren't dying so I was like what the heck so all you have to do is uh, you know go into your playlist where you would play Slayer go down a couple and it will say zombies and you guys should try it out I, this was actually my first zombie match uh, I think probably in months I think I made maybe have played a few in the past but um, I actually won this game which was awesome I, I actually have a fairly decent score for never playing this and considering it was on the first try it was pretty awesome but I have a specific thing to talk about today and it was the controversy the hectic everything going crazy type of situation that we've been dealing with the last couple of days and I'm here to kind of put it to rest and talk about what the situation was um, if you follow me on Twitter and if you don't you should make sure to go follow me the link is in the description as always but I was talking to a few people about this petition that we were starting because supposedly Microsoft updated their rules so that people can't monetize their videos on Halo 4 gameplay now this isn't necessarily true the rules that people are like blowing up about and writing articles, I'm seeing websites write huge articles and stuff like that. What they're talking about is the terms of service um, that Microsoft has had since 2007. And I was watching a video of Hutch. Hutch is an awesome, it just the way he explains shit is so perfect. But he was basically talking about how these companies don't really enforce these laws because of what has changed. Like these rules that they have really doesn't mean much anymore because of how much hype the gaming community has on YouTube and basically he was talking about like how these companies know that these people making videos uh, you know gets them a lot of sales because there was a huge boom in the 2008 and 2009 uh, years where videos for gaming started getting multiple 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 uh, millions of views compared to what they were used to be getting so honestly guys there's no reason to you know blow this out of proportion um, I was actually going to make a video about this yesterday but I thought I would let it wait a little bit and thankfully I did because I was gonna flip out on Microsoft I was gonna be talking about how many you know how many times I've seen videos on a game that I wasn't gonna get and then I wanted to get it and I know you guys know that there's a lot like basically when people make videos on a certain game it's like free advertisement for that game because you're gonna sell copies because people see the gameplay they see one of their favorite youtubers playing it and they're gonna want to get it themselves and what I didn't understand was how they could do this 
And but they weren't smothering us, guys. The rules have been like that because technically, at any point, they can go. Oh, I don't want this video up, which companies rarely do. And that's why I, you know I haven't even been been noticing it on all these videos that I've been posting for Halo Reach. You know, all this whole time I've never had a problem with it. So don't worry, guys. Halo Four is just going to be as good as we think it's going to be that the whole you know it's, it's just something getting blown out of proportion is pretty much what it is and um we just all need to relax including myself because i signed the petition i was all for it i was like yeah bring down microsoft yeah and then i didn't really look into it enough to understand that you know the rules and conditions have been like that for years they just don't enforce them so when it comes to Halo 4, don't worry, I'm going to have plenty of Halo 4 over here. I talked to Bravo about it as well. Everything is okay. Until they go further with these rules and actually enforce them, nothing's changing, guys. It's just going to be like every, you know, any other video game that gets released. It's just they kind of need to keep that in the rules just because it kind of uh, doesn't open up like a, a bunch of different opportunities for companies to take advantage of it and stuff like that so uh there's no need to worry uh everything's going to be fine so i just wanted to clear that up a little bit because you know hutch had to clear that up for me so if you're following me on twitter and you saw this no worries you know it's all over and as you can see i won this zombies match i was pretty ex uh, excited for it oh wait we have another round all right nice i have some more to talk to you guys about i thought that was the end of the game but clearly there was like three three rounds i guess i guess that's how they do it look at this is a nice little triple right here just slowly taking my time so yeah basically i don't know if i noticed or if i mentioned this but when you're shooting the zombies it's kind of like swat where it's like one shot to the head and then uh you know one shotgun shot from short range should do it uh, but this is kind of a fun game type. I don't I don't know. This really isn't a game to oh my god That guy just ran right into a mouthful of lead But um, this isn't a game that a uh, game type that I usually like enjoyed But when I played this it was kind of fun. I don't know uh, The only thing that bothers me sometimes is as you can see in the last round or the round before that uh, They found an area where it was very hard to get to them and you just kind of have to use your wits and as you can see I jumped down from this little hole in the ceiling where I could see exactly where they were. So instead of running all down the tunnel and that almost gave that person the victory over me because he was getting so many kills. Uh, look at how far I jumped right there. Like, come down like a freaking monkey. Just like a fucking ninja monkey. But anyways that's the end of the game. I dropped 21 kills. I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. Only 26 get days guys until... Wow that was a, that was a hard thing to say right there uh 26 days until halo 4 comes out i'm super super excited but i'm also excited for war z um if you haven't seen any war z gameplay uh i actually just posted a daisy video yesterday uh it should be in the description of that video and war z is basically a new game that's just like daisy that's going to be coming out soon as well so there's a lot of new games coming out uh in the holiday season that i'm excited for i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope everyone has a great night take it easy guys